Hello viewers, welcome to my YouTube channel Victory 365 Days. Today in this class we are going to talk about a very important lesson from class 7 called The Turning Point from APJ Abdul Kalam, one of his books called My Teachers. It's an extraction from My Teachers. So Abdul Kalam's life experience is is here all about that's called the turning point what do you mean by the turning point life changing situations in our life we may come across many people or incidents such like that that changes our courses okay of life so that's what one of uh, uh, life changing situation of abdul kalam is described over here so first you see the zest of lesson so in this lesson what we are going to see all in summary in brief i'll explain you so first you see face sheet this is called face sheet so what do you observe here one person and another person they're all looking at each other and they are actually here one disciple okay and his teacher so teacher student so student or disciple he is actually uh, listening to his uh, teacher's advice so he is none other than Mr. Ram Krishna Parma Hamsha and he is his despile called Swami Vivekananda. So Swami Vivekananda is seeking some advices from his Guru Sri Ram Krishna Parma Hamsha. So it is our uh, this way she tells us that we should listen to elders and gain a lot of positive things from them. So this lesson starting up APJ Abdul Kalam's life changing situation. So first phase during world war ii it was the demand for uh, high uh, situation and uh, there were lots of uh, uh, negative impacts all around the world and uh, in his uh, village rameshwaram it was the uh, scarcity of many uh, valuable uh, goods so life was so difficult uh, prices were gone up and it was uh, difficult to afford uh, such things so in during that cases abdul kalam took up a newspaper job he was selling all the papers door to door uh, some tea stalls and uh, some offices in this way he was selling newspapers okay during those uh, experiences he was actually used to read one newspaper and generally he was looking at the pictures and that pictures all about german and uh, british uh, aircraft so he was looking at those aircrafts and those pilots how it flies so in that case he's got uh, such kind of inspiration of flying so he decided that he wanted to fly high so that was the first incident in his life while watching newspaper photos he was actually inspired to fly high so one day he decided to become pilot so next situation one day science teacher after this uh, incident second incident science teacher mr subramanyam Ayer, he was actually explaining on the board about the flying objects like birds how they fly how they flap their wings how they move how they move up and down so he was uh, demonstrating all the structure and he was explaining later he asked the students if they could understood so students said uh, no they were all amazed not at all understood so one day the teacher took them to near seashore and showed them this picture flying birds how they fly how they move and how they actually uh, uses their wings to flap their wings so that they could fly high and uh, glide down so that they can uh, glide smoothly so in this way he showed uh, the live demonstration to all the students after 15 minutes they were so inspired that they could understand the thing the um, uh, activity so easily live examples so he, but uh, for uh, abdul kalam he was so determined that this flying activity will become his part of his life so in this way he started his journey as flying so he wanted to be uh, in the air so later so third what actually it's all of that incident science teachers live example live demonstration changed the life of abdul kalam then he started slowly studying in iit then uh, finally he took up aeronautical engineering then finally uh, he became an engineer 
worked at NASA. So in this way, slowly, gradually, he moved forward, and at, at the end, he finally he launched a missile, and he was the project director of that Prithvi and Agni some missiles India launched. In this fashion, Abdul Kalam got inspired from that flying incidents in his life, and thus he became uh, the eleventh president of India. And uh, he was also the recipient of Bharat Ratna. This is all about turning point lesson from class 7. I hope you understood the concept. The gist of lesson today explained in a brief manner that turning point means somebody's uh, live example or inspiration may turn up our life and we uh, change our life as per our requirement. So his passion, Abdul Kalam's passion become profession. So that's what you are profession must be full of passions so this is what the turning point lesson from class 7th is all about i hope you also have such kind of influential persons who change your life turning point in your career you might have such incidents so this is abdul kalam's turning point and in this way he became the missile man of india that's it for today thank you and have a nice day